Classic Photography. My name is Jürgen Heiland from company Heiland Electronic in Wetzlar, Germany and I'd like to introduce our LED code light source to you. The LED code light source has been designed to expose photo papers, black and white, as well as color papers. Therefore it emits various colors starting with red, blue, green and white and of course any other color which could be added from red, green and blue. Main features of the LED cold light source are it is really a cool light. The LEDs emit no heat, therefore we need no fan, no noise in your dark room and no dust which is emitted from the LED light source. The light output is absolutely stable. The drift is less than one tenth of an f-stop and it does not depend on the exposure time which means if you switch on the light it is immediately on the same intensity as in 100 seconds. Therefore you could create prints today and in three months with the same setting. The LED cold light source is available in various sizes starting from 35mm film up to the biggest ultra large format of 20 by 24 inch and the scope of delivery for that LED cold light source is of course the light source in the size you need. There is a control unit which is available in various versions one for black and white, one for color and another one for split grade control. Next part of the delivery is the adapter. The adapter is individually manufactured for your enlarger and enables you to install the LED code light source by yourself. Finally, the 24 volt power supply and the user's manual are included in the scope of delivery. The details of the light source will be explained in the next short videos. Yeah. In the next step I like to explain the various control units available for our LED cold light source. It starts with the classic black and white control unit. Um, that one is connected to an existing timer or analyzer by an adapter which we deliver. Uh, for the test now I press only the button to switch on the light and you have several settings. It starts with the safe light. The light source emits red safe light. You may also switch to the exposure mode and within that exposure mode you are able to select any color between blue and green to control the paper grade. Finally, there is a white light mode so that you can focus your negative with white light and for all three settings you have the option to dim the light according to your needs so that you can adapt the exposure times as well as the absolute intensity to the scale which you are working with. Also available for the classic control unit is an option um, by an app on a smartphone or on a tablet. That app enables you to select all functions direct from the smartphone now. Uh, it doesn't matter if you like to switch on red or white light or to set various exposures and of course in that case 
you are also able to control the exposure time by your smartphone. Also available is a control box for color applications like exposing RA4 and Ilfochrome papers. It looks similar to the classic box for black and white, but the function of the knobs is different. You have three knobs for the three colors, red, green and blue. And so you are able to control each color in intensity separate. That acts similar like a color head on your enlarger. The setting is done digital and you have a display. You might not see it here in the video because the backlight is not very bright to avoid exposing color papers. Um, a sample shows first something like a red light, then it turns towards white, yellow and green light. So you see any color could be set as you need it. Finally, of course, we have also an adapter for our split grade system. Uh, in case of the split grade system, there are no knobs on the control box because all functions are available in the menus of the split grade. Uh, you might switch on the red light or the white light. And if you start the exposure, there is a sequence from blue and green light and also there's an option to switch on to mixed mode where you might do a continuous exposure with blue and green light on. Yeah, hello again. Now I would like to explain the various sizes and adapters uh, which we offer for our LED cold light source. Of course, it starts with 35 millimeter film. Uh, in that case, now we have a Lights V35 module, which fits directly to, into the slot of the enlarger. Um, you see that it's well manufactured in solid aluminium. Next size is 6x7, 6x9, then 4 by 5 inch, 5 by 7 inch, 8 by 10 inch, and so on. And it ends at actually at the size of 20 by 24 inch. That's the box beside me. Um, for that ultra large format, we have the same system as for the smaller formats. Only difference here are some fans included but these fans are turned on only during white light. About the various adapters, I have two samples here. One is for the Ilford System 500, which means it exactly replaces the light source of the Ilford System 500. Another one as set for uh, lights to see enlarger. So in that case it replaces the bulb of the enlarger and it is located above the condenser. More than 50 different adapters are available and I have written a small note not to forget one of them. We deliver adapters for brands Agfa, Ahel, Aristo, Bessler, Diver, Danko, Durst, Fujimoto, Graf Larger, Homrich, IFF, Jobo, LPL, Kaiser, Kienzle, Lights, Linov, Miopta, Omega, Saunders, Rheinhell, Teufel, Zoom 6 and of course we also offer 
generic light sources without any adapter so that you might manufacture your own individual adapter for your enlarger. Yeah, hello again. Um, now I like to explain some technical details of our LED cold light sources. In principle, we manufacture two different types. The type which is mainly used for 35 mm films um, looks similar to that. That is a LED cold light source for the lights V35, and it consists out of three or four high intensity LEDs of course multi-color LEDs and these LEDs emit the light directly into the existing mixing box. For the larger formats we offer another type which consists out of a rectangular box that already includes the mixing box and the diffuser and if you have a closer look to the LED panel now, you see several hundreds of LEDs capable of emitting red, green and blue light. Depending on the size of the enlarger, we use several panels up to 48 for the biggest format. Thank you for your interest in our LED cold light source. If you need any further information, please have a look to our website or send us an email. Thank you.